activities, including drug trafficking, extortion, and arms smuggling. PKK supporters have carried out attacks targeting Turks and organizations in various parts of Belgium. We urge countries to take immediate steps to reveal the perpetrators of the attacks and bring them to justice and increase security measures for the Turkish missions abroad. One of the most pressing challenges posed by the PKK in Europe is its ability to recruit and radicalize individuals. Through propaganda, indoctrination, and intimidation tactics, the PKK seeks to garner support for its terrorism and perpetuate its violent campaign. As European countries grapple with the challenge of combating PKK terrorism, the need for enhanced cooperation and intelligence sharing among European nations has become increasingly apparent. Only through collective action and a coordinated approach can Europe effectively address the threat posed by the PKK and safeguard the security and well-being of its citizens. The events have once again demonstrated that the PKK poses a threat to public order in the countries where it operates in Europe. We noted operations carried out by French and Belgian authorities against PKK terrorists in April in terms of financing terrorism. Europe were playing with fire by proposing to let Ukraine use Western weapons to strike inside Russia. While on a trip to Uzbekistan, the Russian president told reporters on Tuesday that such strikes could trigger a global conflict. Putin also emphasized that many 